So I'm going to take, let's go with the river trail. And I'll take that to the upper connector. And then we'll hit the, the ridge. That should be pretty good. Ah, oh, this is already mud. <laughs> right off the bat. I know it's just this section, so I'll go for it. <laughs> this is the section actually that one year during the white face sky runs it was pouring and everybody had to run through this i think i, I got some video of that oh this but this is always a wet area look how gorgeous it is this morning right now i'm on the flume loop uh, in the white face wellington area the home of the white face sky races that we have every year uh, the trail running event that's uh, pretty epic and uh, looking forward to this year unfortunately it was cancelled um, but uh, which is why we're here now but camping's open everybody's practicing safe social distancing and uh, we're just out here adventuring getting a little fresh air gorgeous morning it actually felt cool this morning I was like Woo. Woo -hoo. <laughs> oh look at that Woo. all right getting a lay of the land I don't know nothing about these trails so I'll be careful a little wet this morning So that's a bridge. I'll take the bridge. Just looking for the ridge trail now. Make sure I don't pass it. Ooh, the rock. Oh, here's the ridge trail, right? I'm going to say that's the, the ridge. All right, we'll go left. Whew. Ridge trail, all right. We're good. It says 1.5 miles of single track. Whew. See if we can clear this all. to try this section one more time looks like I get it. it's a little wet a little slippery people go up to the left let's see if it's tight okay this is a tough start too <laughs> Whoa. see if I didn't hit that bar it's my bars let's give it one more go okay so I can't hit the bars and I need a lot more speed going in all right there we go Yes, nice. Woo! Yeah, I was hitting my bar on that one. All right, beauty. Oh, thread and needle. Let's see where we're at. All right, down a little bit. All right, so I'm going to Gulo Gulo. Um, coming off the ridge trail. And I'll take that to the poor man's downhill, eventually out to the white face climb. Okay. All right. Okay, here's the Gulo Gulo trail. I'll be jumping in that stream later, or many streams, hopefully. Oh, it's beautiful. All right. I'm 
almost at the toll road now. I'm moving pretty good. Nice steady climbing. I'm locked out on the mountain bike right now. And uh, trying to conserve a little bit now because I really don't know what to expect on this uh, trail. So we'll see. I'm gonna get some electrolytes in me, ease into the beginning. And it uh, looks like it's up ahead. So we'll, we'll see. So that's, and we'll dive into the trail right there. Cooper Kiln Trail. We've got about 5.7 miles of trail, 1,000 climbing, 2,000 feet of descending. Whoo! Average time 111 minutes. Oh, that's a great. All right, the original agony ride. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we'll see how that goes. So here we go. This is supposed to be the trailhead. All right, good, great, no marking. All right, <laughs> let's see what the hell happens. All right, it's supposed to be sensible for the first mile or so. And then uh, there's a big uh, hike a bike section. All right, it's more like it. It's beautiful right now. It feels, I'm not sure what the temps are, maybe mid 70s, warming up, but still very nice at about 8.20 a.m. definitely see how quickly <laughs> the trails can change Ooh. oh all right stand bike Let's see if I can ride all right it's just a little wet out so really you gotta anticipate the first section of hike a bike Ooh. it's just very humid and uh, very wet rock and roots. It's slippery. We'll see how it goes. But I'll keep trying to ride. I'll jump on now. See if I can pedal this. Hoo -ah. Hoo -ah. All right. Hoo -ah. Nice. Hoo -ah. All right. Oh, yeah. I have to lower my PSI a tad more. Oh, all right. Hike a bike. Hike a bike. Hike and a bike. All right. All Oh, and they also said it was going to be muddy. <laughs> Ooh. All right. The ride description is the original Adirondack Agony Ride. Leave a car in Wilmington and ride up or shuttle to the start at the trailhead nearby the White Face Toll Road. I rode up and uh, took it to Galipsy Drive. It came from Wilmington Notch Campground and rode the Flume Loop and all that. So I'm here now. The first mile is rideable single track that slowly climbs up, which it was. Then the hike, a bike begins. And that goes on for about another one plus miles of climbing until you arrive at a more moderate terrain at approximately 3,200 feet of elevation. That's, I'm approaching that now. The next mile is narrow and tricky and really beautiful single track that winds through high elevation spruce fir forest before dropping down to Cooper Kiln Pond and a lean-to. All right, so that's what I got to look forward to. The last short stretch of the trail before arriving at the pond is a muddy mess. Leaving from the pond, the trail drops sharply down the eastern flank of the mountain and quickly turns into a nasty, eroded, boulder-filled gully for about a mile. Oof. Oh boy. This is survival riding on a trail bike. After a creek crossing, the trail mellows for another mile before dropping again for a two-mile all-out rip to Bonneview Road. 
All right, let's uh, <laughs> let's continue on. Yep. All right, let's get to the top and ride that beautiful single track and pretend that uh, muddy mess in Boulder Field is doesn't exist until I get there, and I'll worry about that when I get there. Oh boy. So far, that little hike a bike section was worth it just to see this beauty. Oh man, I'm gonna be able to ride through these forests to smell them. This is absolutely stunning. Watch that rear derailleur. Okay. Well, this is supposed to be the trail. <laughs> oh, shit. All right. Well, so I got to... I'm on the trail. So cross this without swimming. Oh, or getting lost. All right. What? Let's try this way. Oh. Okay. Let's see. There's something there. All right. Ooh, nice. I guess, uh, little dinner for somebody down here, a little kill. Jeez. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Oh, there's a trail marking. Got something. All right. No problem. Woo. All right. Oh. Check this out. Well, definitely a trail. All right, looks like we go this way. I could rode that for sure. That's pretty cool. I would imagine it'd be pretty buggy. Beautiful area though. All right. Let's see what we got ahead. That was pretty cool. Definitely a fun trail to, you know, doing what I'm doing, biking and hiking. It, it's I love adventures like this. I'm I'm fine. I enjoy stuff like this, uh, and I found a lot of beauty in it. But this would be a fun trail, definitely to run and hike. Ooh, do you try to cross that? <laughs> no. <laughs> uh, play it safe, since I'm the only one out here. I got no one to save me. So I've minimized risks as much as I can. Oh, oh, yeah. oh man down. Ooh, this is gnarly stuff. All right, yeah, time to walk the bike. 
I guess I could have gone up that way. <laughs> gnarly, 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 gnarly. Oh, oh nice. Uh, we got, I guess we're going straight. And then we're going left. Oh, no. Okay, we're stopping here. That's rideable. If I stayed up top and came down, I could have came off this, but also I do not want to bust myself nor the bike. Looks like people did the high. There's a highway. Looks like now I'm on the last little bit of stretch of this uh, pretty epic trail. I don't know if I have a boulder field remaining or if I hit it, but we're going to find out. amazing that was a gnarly ride so now I'm about to pop out on Bonnie view road something like that and that's the completion of that trail that was uh that was definitely an adventure riding at its finest oh I think I'm gonna take John Bliss now over to Hardy Road need to have a little lunch now Ooh. oh I saved it 